Hello everyone, this is Glenn Irvin and this is a quick video about creating assignments, a best practice of creating assignments inside of Schoology and how it differs from something that we actually told you at the beginning of the year. I have found out that when you create an assignment, you put your name, your description in here, any kind of links and attachments and those kinds of things. And then you of course choose your whatever quarter is going to be in and it automatically defaults the first quarter. Here's the important part right here where it says numeric scale you can choose your own scale like for example I have this urban scale but what ends up happening is that there's this annoying pop-up when you're trying to input grades uh, whether it be inside the gradebook or just actually uh, putting them in uh, that pops up that shows you kind of the grading scale in order to avoid that all you need to do is uh, do what I've done here which is basically any assignment you create just choose numeric and that will show the kids the number point value of that specific assignment so for example they got 270 out of 300 and then when you have your specific class you can just go back into your grade setup like we've talked about before and make sure that your grading scale is whatever grading scale you want it to be whether it be the, for example for me the urban scale or this a plus minus scale and then what will end up happening is that their total grade it'll show a uh, both a percentage and then it'll also show the A plus, B, whatever type of scale there. So when you create the assignments, I would choose numeric, but on your grade setup, I would choose either the A plus minus or your specific grading scale, and that will save you lots of hassles and issues. If you have questions, let me know. Send me an email. Bye-bye.